We're almost ready for the International Kids Praise Potluck. I'm so excited. Me too, Dad. I'm glad we're having it at the Worship Workshop. There's so many instruments and crazy gadgets to play with here. Yeah, it's fun to learn about the Lord with the Songmobile. The incredible music quizzical quilt. And now, your new invention. Ooh, 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 I can't wait to see how it works and what it does. <laughs> Rhythm, help me lift this giant paper mache heart up on the wall. Dad, why are we hanging this heart on the wall? And why did you send out heart-shaped invitations to all the kids in the neighborhood? And why did you send invitations to us? We're your booklets. We live with you. You could have just told us about the potluck. I have something very special to share with you and the kids tonight. And that's why I'm having all the kids dress up in international costumes. And bring food from different countries? Yup. But why, Dad? What's it all about? You'll see. Oh, here come the kids now. Come on in, everybody. Come on into the workshop. Come into the workshop. Come into the workshop. Come into Salty's Worship Workshop. Welcome to the International Kids Praise Potluck. I got lots to share with you tonight, so put the food on the table next to the plates, silverware, and chopsticks, <laughs> and let's get started. Hey, did you see somebody at the window? I don't know. Did you see someone, Harmony? There was nobody there. How come you're in your pajamas, Marty? I don't know. The invitation said to wear pajamas, a straw hat, and bring a big bowl of fried rice. Who are you supposed to be? I don't know either. My invitation said to carry fruit in a basket on my head. And I was supposed to bring some stuff called flan. Salty, we really like the heart-shaped invitations you sent us. Yeah. yeah, and it smells good in here. Why did you tell us to dress up in all these funny clothes, Salty? What's the reason for this potluck dinner with all these different kinds of foods? I have something special I want to tell you about. Did you know that when it's daytime on our side of the earth, it's nighttime on the other side, and there are children sleeping while you're up playing and going to school? You mean, when we're sawing Z's, they're up doing stuff? That's right, Willie. There are children and grown-ups all over the world that we've never seen or met. Do they live in different countries? I bet they wear different kinds of clothes, like what we're wearing. 
Correct. And they eat different kinds of foods. Like what we brought? Exactly. They speak different languages than we do, too. For real, Dad? For real, Rhythm. But it's most important to know that God loves them just as much as he loves you and me. I memorized a verse from the Bible about that. You did? Can you share it? John 3, 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. John 3, 16. Well, you do know that scripture. Hey, I've got a song on my pages that goes to those words. Come on, Sally, you start it. reason for the heart decorations. I want to talk to you tonight about having a heart to love the people around the world. But Salty, I've never been any place farther than the park on the other side of town. Yeah, we don't know about the people on the other side of the world. Well, I'm glad you said that. Can we have a drum roll rhythm? And now, for the unveiling of my latest invention, Kids praisers, I introduce to you the amazing, the stupendous, the remarkable new Salty Scope. What is it? What does it do, Pops? The Salty Scope has the ability to zoom in on areas of need in the world. How does it work, Salty? You see, this giant viewing screen is attached to the image generator, which is connected to the specific location indicator, which flows constantly through this series of condensers. The image reversedly passes along this coat hanger through these laser tubes, powered by the centrifugal forces of gravity, accentuated by the whirring of soup in this can, and all in conjunction with the physical laws of inertia when you or I, by the simple flick of the wrist, spin this globe. Right. When the globe comes to rest, a picture of that specific location is projected on the screen. The Salty Scope is unique. It shows us places in the world where people need to see and hear about the love of God. And it shows us places where He might want us to go. Us? Of course. But, Dad, 
How are we going to know where to go if we don't know where the people are? That's just the point of the Salty Scope. It's an educational device to help us learn about the people in the world. Let's see how it works, Dad. Great. Harmony, you give it the first spin. These children are from the Chachi Indian tribe of South America. The man standing next to them holding the book is a Bible translator who is working on putting the Bible into the Chachi language. Then the people can read the Bible in words they understand. The Chichi, or uh, the Choo Choo, uh... The Chachi! Yeah, they're really, uh, different looking. <laughs> they think the same about you, too. This is fascinating. What kind of foods do they eat? They're farmers, Hannah, so they grow their food. They eat mostly fruit called plantanos. It's like a banana. Dad, this is really exciting. There's more. Let's spin the globe again. Willie, you do it this time. Thanks, Salty. This harmony is Kampuchea. The airplane you see is flown by missionaries carrying doctors and medicine to a hospital. Salty, what's a missionary? Someone who God sends to share his love with other people. Wow! When I grew up, could I be a missionary and fly a plane? You sure could. I want to be one of the doctors. This is interesting, Salty. Can we spin the globe again? Be my guest. This is a village school in Ethiopia. The children here are learning about the love of Jesus. When they first came, they were very hungry. But here, they get good food to eat from people who care. And now, people who God has sent are teaching them how to grow their own food so they won't be hungry anymore. Salty, I like learning about other people. I want to learn more in case God might want me to go someday.
the salty scope again. Yeah. It's my turn! It's my turn! I get to do it now! Just a second, Harmony. Let me get out of the way. All looking in the window. Oh, he goes to our church. I think his name is Jimmy. Why is he on the salty scope? He doesn't live on the other side of the world. There are people with needs right here in our own country, in our own city, in our own neighborhood, maybe even in our own home. Jimmy's dad's been out of work. I think they're having trouble making ends meet or even buying food. But why isn't Jimmy at the potluck? I invited him. I told him he couldn't come if he didn't bring anything. What? Harmony, why did you do that? This is a potluck. Everybody is supposed to bring something. He didn't have anything to bring. But Harmony, there's plenty of food here. We would have loved to have Jimmy come. Well, I wanted to make sure there would be enough for me. Let's eat! Spaghetti, ravioli, mostacholi, artichokes, but this plate is much too small. I need room to eat it all, so I'll drink up all the punch and use the bowl to eat my lunch. Make a sandwich to the ceiling, watch me do it now with feeling. Goop some mustard and some custard on this mondo loaf of bread. Lettuce, turkey, pickles, cheese, scarf the whole thing down with these. Pat my belly, eat some jelly, don't forget the chip and Too. If you're thinking only of you, there's a room here filled with people who are all so hungry too. That's their problem. I was here first and my hunger's getting much worse. As we dally while we rally, I could eat another course. I only think about yourself when there are people who are hungry, not only here but round the world. I didn't bring you up like this. You must be caring, loving, and sharing. Your little heart is gone a missile. surprised at you. You didn't even wait till we blessed the food. You and I need to have a little talk. Willie and I are gonna find Jimmy, Dad. He must feel really bad. We'll bring him back. Good. Harmony, let's go into the other room. Jimmy, I wish I could be at the potluck with all the other kids. But even if they don't want me, I know you do. Lord, I don't have fancy toys like I My clothes are faded and torn My shoes are scuffed up and all worn Though the world might think I'm poor I am rich cause I have you, Lord Lord, the people stop and then pass as though I am not there 
Jimmy, Rhythm and Willie, what are you guys doing here? We came to bring you back to the potluck. Jimmy, I'm sorry for what my sister Harmony said to you. It wasn't very nice. Come on back to the potluck with us. The kids all want you to. Really? Yeah, let's go. Ooh, it's cold outside. Here, Willie, take my coat. Wow, thanks, Jimmy. Come on, my dad's got this neat new invention. It's called the Salty Scope. The way it works is you spin this globe. And it goes from the Sometimes when we have too much, we forget who gave it to us. Do you kids know what it's very important to be? This is baffling. What do you mean, Salty? <laughs> For all the things God has given us, what is it important to be? Thankful. It's important to be thankful. That's right. God loves it when we have thankful hearts. And I've got a song on page 43 all about it. I'll turn your pages, Salty.
Dad, I'm thankful for all the things we have and all the good things God does for us. But I can't stop thinking about all the people who are poor, those who have needs, and those who haven't heard about Jesus. That's good, Melody. God wants us to be concerned about those people because He loves them. Salty, what are some of the ways we can help? Well, let's think about what God might want us to do. At Christmas and birthday times, I'll buy an extra present for someone who wouldn't get one. I'll earn some money helping my mom and dad around the house, and then I'll send the money to help a kid who might need clothes or something to eat or even a Bible. I'm going to invite my next-door neighbor over for dinner. I want her to know all about Jesus. I'm going to even be nice to my little sister so she can see how much God loves her through me. That's the idea. Jesus said we are the light of the world, and we want to let that light shine so bright that all the world can see it. We're His hands, His feet, and His voice. He'll use us to show the world His love. Dad, could we put together a big basket of food right now for Jimmy and his family? Can we? Yeah, please. Here's the basket. Get started. <laughs> Jimmy, we really missed you. Hi, everybody. 
Jimmy, get a plate and have some chop suey. Thanks. Saucy, can we give Jimmy his present now? You bet. We put together a big basket of food and stuff for your family. Wow, thank you all so much. I know my parents will really appreciate it. Thank you, everybody. You're welcome. You're welcome. Jimmy, do you want to see how the salty scope works now? Could I? Come up here and give it a spin. This is fun. A church. Astonishing. It is our church. Why is our church on a salty scope? Hmm. I wonder who that could be. Hi, Salty. Pastor Smith, come in. I just stopped by to see how you and the kids were doing. We're absolutely marvelously wonderful, Pastor Smith. Really? What have you all been up to? We've been learning about the people all around the world. We've been learning that God can use us to show them his love. Yeah. And, Pastor Smith, we've been learning to let our light shine. Yeah. This thin light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This thin light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This thin light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Every day, every day, every day, and every day.
Kids are so talented. Praise the Lord. Look, Pastor Smith, our church is on the salty scope. Is there someone at our church with a need? There are lots of needs at our church. Hey, I've got an idea. Salty, would you and the Kids Praise Kids come to church this Sunday night and share with the congregation what God has been putting in your hearts? Would we? Yay! That would be our privilege. Great. We'll see you there. Welcome, everyone, to our Sunday evening service. Tonight we have some special visitors. Salty and the Kids Praise Kids are here to share with us. Let's give them a warm welcome. This is a great big world we live in. There are people everywhere who have never heard what Jesus did for them. There are people who are hungry, cold, and lonely, and they don't know that Jesus loves them. These people might live in another country, or they might live in our own neighborhood and go to our own church. They might even live in our own homes. We can be the ones God uses to help them. Yeah, we can be His hands to reach the world. It all starts in our own hearts. With a heart of love, we can reach out and see God do miracles. By God's grace and in God's strength, we can change the world. to sing in every boy and girl. Start to share, start to care from a heart of love. Let the world know that Jesus loves them.
I brought along my new salty scope to show you how the kids and I have been learning about the people and places in the world where there are needs. Who wants to give it a spin? I do, Salty. All right, Jimmy, give it a whirl. Lots of book covers, a Mondo sticker collection, more food than I can possibly eat. I don't need anything except a change in my heart. Jimmy, I'm sorry for telling you not to come to the potluck. Will you forgive me? Of course I will, Harmony. Dad, I'd like to say something. Well, lately my heart's been filled up with a lot of me. I've been so worried about how much I can get for myself. I forgot about how much God has done for me. Dad, I want to let Jesus have my whole heart. That's my little booklet. Sing this song together and give Jesus our whole hearts. 